Right, what are you telling me, people? Spirit Judo's back in the building. And this is all a part of my journey. Every video that I'm dropping, everything that I'm talking about, every topic is all a part of my journey. That's what I realised. Like, it's like I get these topics at a certain point in my journey because I don't even know how I even get these ideas for these videos myself. You know what I mean? I just come up with them and make something happen. You know what I mean? But shit, right. Um, chosen Ones. When we enter to tw when we enter into the new year twenty twenty three, make sure you enter on a clean slate. You know what I mean. Enter on a clean slate and enter it without people. You know what I mean. We made it all the way to here, all on our own. No one helped us. You gotta understand. The longer we came, we made it all by ourselves, and no one helped us. This is why I tell you not to be helping everyone out here and giving them your hand out and bringing people along with you because not everyone's going to be able to go. See, what I realise now, not everyone's going to be able to go where, where we're going. So, get in the habit of just loving your own company and just loving yourself because not everyone's going to be able to go. And that's what you got to understand because they didn't put no work in. They just been watching secretly behind the scenes and they're just gonna have to continue. They're still the con they're still gonna be continuing to do the same thing, watching behind the scenes secretly, and watching our every move. You know what I mean? This is all these people are gonna do until we get massive, bro. And then they can't do nothing, bro. Literally. But yeah, this is the message just for all the selected beings out there that are pushing forward to this better, bigger things in their life. Because we're getting to a point where. Not everyone can come with us, you know what I mean? Not everyone can come with us. And you always gonna you gotta get in the mindset of that. See you came you came a long ass way just like me. And now that we come this far, you gotta get in the habit of just cutting ties with people. Now now that the Lord showed me true um people's true um feelings about me and how they see me and then you know what I mean, what and how what they have done to me, you know what I mean? The Lord's already showed me everything that he needs to show me so now this now you have to get to the point where you just cut ties with people that are not needed no more you know what i mean and yeah because we're entering the season where we're going to start to get all that blessings and all the things that we've been sowing you know what i mean all them seeds that we've been planting in the ground har like harvesting is now being it's now being harvested in 2023 and this is why I tell you to be ready and prepared for all of these blessings that are coming through because you put in the hard work to get it and this is why I'm telling you to get prepared and start removing the people that don't need to be there. It's either you do it or the Lord's going to do it himself anyway. You know what I mean? You don't have to do nothing. Like The Lord already removes people from your life or, like that don't need to be there when you're connected to him. See, now that I'm connected to him, it's like he just does it automatically. I don't have to do nothing, bro. And that's the that's the habit you want to get in, just letting the Lord deal with people because dealing with people by yourself, bro, it's not even worth your energy, I'm telling you. But yeah, huh? Man, big things are to come. Big things are to come. 2023 is a whole new year. Keep your head up high, chosen beings, because more is, more is out there for us. I'm telling you, you've got more coming in store for us. Just watch and wait what the Lord has in store for us. I'm telling you, most of you are going to be shocked. I'm going to be shocked of all the things that he's going to shock me with. You know what I mean? And this is what I'm telling you. If you know you've been through a lot of shit in your life, just be prepared for all of the things that are coming in. So all these past friends and all these past family members, all these past people, leave these people where they're at, bro, because... When we're going through our hard, for our hardships and our hard times in our life, who was there for us? No one. And this is why I tell you, don't be um, letting all these people back in and letting people drop all their burdens on you. When, when you're going through your own shit, who was there for you? You know what I mean? Who was there for me when I was going through my shit? No one. Literally, no one was there. And this is why I'm going to enjoy these blessings on my own when they do start to come in. And when they do come in, be silent about it as well. Don't be. 
don't be like, oh my god, like telling everyone that you're alive, you're living living life because most of these people, I'm telling you, some people left us for dead, bro. Some people wrote us off and left us for dead. You gotta understand. And this is why the Lord don't want you to just be showing off like our, our YouTube platform and just what we have in general because I'm telling you, some people, some there's some evil people out there still still plotting our downfall and still hate hate us for where we are today. And this is why I tell you not to be all like in any like all nice to all these people out here because most people didn't even want it, want us to make it where we are today. And this is why I tell you to be low key. I'm telling you, be low key in 2023. 2023, be low key. And don't be telling everyone your business that don't need to know. You know what I mean? Because I just got to the point where I just keep shit to myself now because it's like, it's like, bro, it's like I don't, I don't trust people, but I'm telling you, I don't trust people. You know what I mean? You'll tell someone, I've, I've told family shit before, no, they'll, they'll go and tell my, tell, tell people things that I, they shouldn't be telling them, you know what I mean? Personal business. But it's okay because I learned, I learned bro, I learned not to just tell people shit out here and all this extra stuff because people are not trusted bro, I'm telling you, don't be, tr if you're chosen bro, don't be trusting all these people out here because when it's all said and done, people are sneaky bro, I've seen it in my own eyes too many times that I'm not, I'm not going to be deceived and fooled again by someone putting a mask on their face, pretending to be nice. But the whole time they're just doing all this shit behind my back, bro. You know what I mean? That's why I just stay as an introvert, unseen retention, and just progress in silence, bro. Because see, now no one no now no one can stop stop me and hinder my my progress anymore because you don't know what's happening in my life or what is happening, you know what I mean? Everything's like a big surprise in my life because you're not a part of it, so every time when you see something, it's like a surprise. You know what I mean? Shit. But yeah, the the Lord's blessed us. You gotta thank the Lord every day for the sit for the situations that He brought us out of. From what the Lord's brought us out of to where He brought us today, I'm telling you, you better thank Him every day because what these people put us through. These people left us for dead, bro, I'm telling you. And this is why I tell you to leave these people for dead now. Literally, now I leave these people for dead, bro. That's right, bro, I'm telling you. All these people from the past and shit, but I just ignore these people because... Literally, you're going to reap your karma, mate. And this is... Literally, just laugh at these people, bro, because they're going to reap so much karma in their life for coming up against us. And the fact is, they did it for no reason as well. That's the funny thing. No reason, but it's okay because you're not needed no more anyway. <laughs> but yeah, chosen ones, get prepared to all of these blessings because you earn it. See, I've earned it. I know I've earned it and you've earned it. So get ready. Get ready, man. Get ready because it's only up and up from here and telling you. From where we came from, it's only up and up from here. And this is why I tell you to always keep your head up high, keep your head up high. And keep pushing forward because bigger bigger things are just around the corner. And all of these people that did all these things to us are going to reap what they have sown. You watch, bro. All these fools that came up against us secretly, spoke things over our life and did things behind our back are going to start reaping all that, all that shit. You watch. They're going to be going through hell in their life and... The thing is, when they go through this hell, they won't know how to overcome it. They won't know how to get through all of these trials and tribulations because they're weak, bro. Why do you think they're coming up against us in the first place? Because they're weak individuals, mentally and spiritually. And they saw us. They, they knew we were tough, a tough being. And this is why them demons inside them came up against us in the first place. Because they knew we were above them the whole time. And it's like their de demons are just irritated by our spirit, bro. But yeah, you just got to learn how people's spirits work out here and how people really are because, man, there's some evil individuals out here. But yeah, fucking over. Stay tuned, man. And 
I'll see you in the next one. But I'm out. Peace.